So now all you need to do is slide the lid onto your flavour stone, get a medium heat under it here. And this is going to take about 40-ish minutes. Keep an eye on it. It's going to build up a good head of steam in there and that convection heat that builds up as well from that even induction base is what's going to help us cook. You may at some stage, in about 15 to 20 minutes, want to add a splash more water. Just keep an eye on it. It's going to be a little beauty. What a pleasure. Now, when it comes to lifting your pot roasted macadamia chicken out of your flavour stone, it may fall apart. It's got to be said. Just fair warning. Straight onto a nice big bed of rocket. And then I'm going to lift off this kumara. All those beautiful juices have soaked up. We've got a little bit of oil in the bottom. That's just the natural oil that's come out of the chicken. This is one of those dishes that once you've got all of your, your food out, give your flavour stone a quick rinse under the tap. And it will be spotless. Hi, I'm James Reeson from Alive and Cooking. Whether we're in my kitchen or on some of Australia's most beautiful locations, I've always got easy to prepare recipes that anyone in the family can whip up. If you feel like trying one of my recipes, it's easy. Just log on to aliveandcooking.com.au for all the recipes and methods as seen on the show. If someone in the family could do with a bit of extra help in the kitchen, you can even order one of my DVDs or cookbooks to give them a hand. So, join me every weekday afternoon and I'll see you in the kitchen.